In this example, we will generate an NC program for the Quake flame cutter. In this cap window, you can see a part with a three holes. It's a plate, and to generate an NC program, we will follow the procedure you have to follow. First, uh, you can define a plate size of which the part is being cut from. So you can enter a name for the program. You can call it our part, for example. The material of the plate, the thickness and the size, for example, 1000 and in Y, 600. And we click on OK. And there's our plate. Now to uh, tell Tensor that you need to cut the outer profile from the outer side, we will select the outer profile and we will move to Koike menu and we will copy the profile into layer 20. And the same accounts for the holes. We will have to copy the holes to layer 10 inner profiles. So we copy the, the inner profiles to layer 10. Now if we select our part, we can uh, position our part in accordance with the plate and we can select a reference point, in this case the lower left corner, so we'll enter 1 and we will, we will enter an allowance of 10 millimeters in, in X and in Y and so there's our part. We can take a look at the parameters, uh, for example the cutting feed we can define here the rapid movement, the burning time it takes to cut through the plate before it starts cutting the profiles and the length of the approach lines we can change into for example 5 millimeters and we'll click on OK. These values will be used in calculating the machining time. So if we now select the part we already took care of that the inner profiles are in layer 10 and the outer profile in layer 20 and we can move to NC programming and Tensor will now automatically define an approach on the profiles and convert this into an NC program. We can enter uh, how many copies we want in X direction for example five copies or four and in Y we want two copies and Tensor will present this size of the part which is in X122 and 149 in Y and we can define a space in between the copies that's for us in this case say 10 millimeters then we'll click on OK and the copies are automatically being generated by Tensor and convert it into an NC program and Tensor will present the cutting time and the length of the cutting path so you might use this for a calculation and we'll click on OK and Tensor will present this in a text file which you can print or for example and give it to the man who's controlling the machine. We can close this. Now if you want an extra part we want to add an extra part to this program, let's say for example this part and we'll draw an extra line and we'll close it by trimming it. We can zoom in and let's say we want a copy of this. We can move to Koike and rotate this geometry and let's say 180 degrees and we would like a copy. OK, so it's now being copied and we can click on cancel and we can move the part, let's say, to this direction and we can then select those two parts and move to layer 20 and we can position it right here And we can convert this into a program also by moving from Quake to NC programming. 
and we can enter a number of copies in this case only in the y direction let's say four copies and we'll click on OK and the NC code of these profiles is being added to the current program so we'll click on OK Tensor will recalculate the machining time and print this into a text file. So if you're done programming this uh, plate, you can move to quite an end of program. So the MO2 is being added to the program. And now you can save this program as a text file to your hard disk or to your USB stick and copy this to your Quaker controller. So this is an uh, example how to generate code for the Koike machine, which is quite easy as you can see.